Hello everybody, welcome back to Binding Lies Afterbirth Hunt for Mega Blast, apparently. Anyway, I don't really know what we did last run, but we are going to do another one of those special seeds. Now this one is known as Face Down. Mystery Cards! Okay. Um, let's play on normal. I mean, I've shown pretty well that I can handle myself on uh, hard. Mm. So let's just do normal. Maybe things will go my way, but more in normal, I don't know. I'm not entirely sure what was on in that room either. Anyway, phase down. Pretty simple. You can't see what your tarot cards do if you get them. So, if you don't come across any tarot cards, this entire seed is pointless. If you do come across them, yay! Am I right? I'm, 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 I'm right. Um, yes. We got canes that are high. Yeah. Eh. It'll do things that may or may not be useful to me. I don't know. We'll never really know, unless someone constantly pays attention to that, which I wouldn't recommend, because that would be rather boring. Alright. Get it? Yeah! Yeah! There you go. Got a kill. Now we're all happy. There we go, just got another one. Look at that. Surprise, surprise! Who knows what it is? I'm gonna assume that this is a Joker card. And therefore, I'm not gonna use it on this floor because my D6 isn't ready yet. Let's do a magic trick! <laughs> I'm gonna look down. <sighs> anyway. Let's go beat up our first ball save. Which is going to take quite a while, it seems. Because the dude that just has tons of health did not get any... ...things either, spirit hearts, that is. Which kind of sucks a bit. Granted. can add things to our collection here, so... Doesn't this give us a spirit heart? Yeah, black heart's cool. Alright, thank you, kindly. So we're not using this card on the next floor either, not until we've... ...checked that we indeed are not getting a devil room. I'll try not to waste the spirit hearts. I know it's not an easy task, but let us try. <clears throat> Manly battle cry was used, and it worked. I think. Anyway, yes, one more item, one elusive little tidbit of. Bits. We know it's in our pool because we've seen it already. Let's try this. Ah, uh, well. Is there another marked one? Mm, I might as well open some more of these. Yeah, and as long as we get bombs out of them. Might as well blow up as many rocks as I can with this. Crawl spaces are a thing. Wasn't that a lug down? Fair amount, okay. And our final two bombs are not going to be wasted on opening that. <coughs> I 
At least not yet. If you don't get a key to this entire floor, then it will, but... Anyway, what I'm not playing on hard mode does for us is basically more consumable drops. I think. M more curses as well, I think, so... You know, it's not that enemies deal less damage or anything. That uh, whole not getting a key thing was a bit of a joke, though, so, you know, feel free to supply me with one. Whenever you're ready. And go for this one now before it spits out too many spiders. <coughs> not really a key, but I suppose I could bomb my way into a potential secret room. Which may be located here. And then go buy a key. Nope. And that item is pretty bad, so. No. Alright, so we have two bombs on pretty much nothing. Blighted Oven. Brimstone generally doesn't get me, but it was in a weird spot that time. Spinning around, doing nothing. Alright, latch key not great, and if we could now just simply get Mega Blast. No. Reroll. No. Let's get this. Guarantee deals with the double in the future. And we do have keys now for the item room. And we can buy a battery to charge up RD6 if the item in there is horrible. I think that's poison shots. But a chance for getting black hearts if it kills an enemy? Uh, something along those lines. Deal with the devil room is still there. You think we could take this risk to buy a battery and expect it still to be there? It's worth a shot. I mean, every time we. Yeah, it's still there. Alright. Book of Belial. Not a bad item, but... Anyway. It's five cents. Sort of wasted, I think. I mean, if that would have been Goathead. Things would have been really cool. There's a purple one in there. Okay. Alright. Yep, that's a black heart. So we can get a black heart if we kill an enemy who's poisons. At least a good chance for one. So, that basically means our HP issues are probably over. Just need a bomb to go and collect them all. Mm. Gotta grab them all. Black hearts. Hey, hey. Kill it. Gotta keep in mind that we got this thing going on as well. Kill it. Bunch of messed up rooms. Gotta make good use of the black powder. Which is something you can actually do now that you're still fairly early on. Get it, get it, get it, make a giant one, make a giant one. Do it, 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 do it. Nope. We're gonna need more speed if we wanna pull a stunt like that. Well, at least we still have little ones. Yeah, our health situation is probably resolved. Alright, we're gonna have to start going to curse rooms as well then.
doors are open. I'm gonna make sure my D6 is filled up though, just in case we get a ooh, teleport to Devil Room. Oh, there's our boss room anyway. Might as well go check that out. I don't think you're gonna get uh, affected by our black powder solely based on the fact that you're a flying enemy, which probably is proof enough. Could probably use you to farm health, but you know, there's no real reason to do that. Not really sweating it when it comes down to HP. And the good thing is, the black hearts, which I just realized, have Necronomicon effect, so I can get poison a bunch, get hit, have a black heart, kill everyone in the room, get more black hearts. It's a never ending cycle of awesomeness. No, don't lose your head about it. And just squeeze on out of here. One of the few bosses that actually follows logic, it seems. Don't you find it weird, like, in any game, the more you injure the boss, the stronger he becomes? I'm near death, I shall now use even more power because of it. I mean, sure, there's adrenaline and stuff like that that can make you make a little bit stronger, but if you're like inches away from death, I don't think you're gonna spout out like a super move anymore. Cube of meat or ball of bandages? Take your pick, ladies and gentlemen. I think ball of bandages is better basically just because of the fact that you can have charm tears if you have two, which is something Super Meat Boy does not have. Other than that, pretty much the same. Oh, goodies. Let's see what this is. Well, color me surprised. It actually was a Joker card. Alright, so <clears throat> what we do here is, well, unfortunately, the plan here was to blow open as many skulls if there was an item in any of them. That could also be re-rolled, but unfortunately, no. The question is, do I take a lump of coal if that's what's going to be offered to me? Mm. <laughs> well, I think that's the first time I ever dodged that properly without panicking. I don't know. I could use, I could use the damage up. I mean, if you give a scrap of his head, it's easy peasy lemon squeezy, and we're gonna take it. But I just walk in and get it over with. And we don't know what it is. Even better. Uh, what is it? Head of Krampus. Okay. Razor Blade. Even worse. We get one bomb. Which I didn't know where we got that from. And we get another phase down tarot card, which we'll probably use in a room that has combat in it. Then spawn a uh, donation machine or something, and they're like, boom, surprise. I don't know, man. Let's not bother with that. Alright, big room with hopefully combat in it. And we can pop this tarot card, see what it does. It's. From the looks of it, that was a. Uh, judgment card. But I don't see a beggar anywhere. I don't even know if the image that he holds out when you use a tarot card differs from depending on the card you're using. 
But I'm pretty sure that was a uh, beggar card. Well, a judgment card. So... Now that I look at things, I'm actually wrong, and it was a world card. Okay. Well, now we know where our secret room is. Unfortunately, we can't get into it. Yeah, it was a world card, right? I suppose those two cards look a little similar. I can actually check because I do have a second edition Binding of Isaac tarot card deck of my own. I really like the images on it. Nifty thing. It also has normal face cards. And, well, like uh, clubs and diamonds and spades and whatnot. Oddly enough, it, do it has um, 14 per suit. I I had no idea such a thing even existed. I thought it was all just uh, diamonds, clubs, hearts, and spades. Which makes no sense because you do only get those four suits. What I mean is you actually have 14 cards per suit, going from ace to ten. And then you have... actually I can uh, have a peep at that. Um, I think it's like... Jack, Queen, King, and another thing with a J, like... Ah, let's just have a peep at that. Oh, tarot cards, my tarot cards. Come here, you. A wonderful deck of wonderness. That's a tarot card. There we go. So we got... Ace of hearts, two of hearts, three, four, five... Ten of hearts, and then it's page of hearts, knight of hearts, queen of hearts, and king of hearts. I don't think that's the Joker. Jokers tend not to have a suit. As far as I can remember. So, page, knight, queen, and king. Hello. Goodbye. Pop up on my screen. Just putting away the card back in their little paper cardboard box that's has a print of an actual wooden chest on it. Anyway, let's carry on. So yeah, I didn't even know that stuff existed. A bit weird. But may I have oh wait, was there a bomb for sale? Not even that. You bunch of jerkwalls. Alright, might as well go check out that trap room. Monster trap room, gauntlet room, whatever. You guys want to name? Apparently there's a black card in here? Oh yeah, it's on top of the, uh, well, below the red heart. Sneaky, sneaky. Alright, give me bombs. And I can't even see what the runes are. Okay. Let's use it. Burkano. Companionship. Well, that was a waste of our time. And a key, I suppose. Well, maybe we get a bomb drop out of this. And then it can turn out that the secret room is also a waste of our time. Well, we got our key back, so. Uh, huzzah! Alright. No more curses, please. At least not the one that prevents us from seeing what our items are. A golden key that I can't get to. <clears throat> How wonderful. Yeah, run into the ball of bandages. Do it. There you go. Getting killed by a ball of bandages. That must be some twisted dream of someone, right? Well, let's go in here. Get some flies. Let's 
Then again, I have seen a video where someone got run over by an ambulance. So, you know. That was pretty hard thud as well. She didn't die or anything, but she was pretty damn injured. And fun thing is, the ambulance actually didn't take her with them because they already had someone in there. <sighs> Another ambulance was sent to go and collect her, so. Rune bag. A lot of bats, isn't it? Using the ball of bandages whenever it's handy again, health really isn't going to be a problem, I would reckon. Could really use some extra damage though. I think we're still doing base. And while it's generally all about the base, not really in this situation. That's the destruction one, meaning that really didn't serve as any purpose whatsoever. Go get him, dead bird! Be a hero! Just look at that ball of bandage do its job. My goodness. An HP up, we don't really need. Turn him into the box. Mystery cards! Blood bank! Might as well make use of this. I don't think I really want the blood bag. Although it is a speed up and combined with a black powder. And it's the IV bag anyway. Well, that's a good thing, which means we can take this with us and turn all those. 48 hour energy. Oh, nice. We can reroll the IV bag once we're done with it. Um which means I should go look for our second secret room. Why? I don't know. I think I'm mixing this up with something completely different. Not worthy of my bomb. I'm gonna go wait until I get another heart. See if I can use this thing multiple times, which was a thing you could actually do previously. But I heard some rumors that that might no longer be the case. Uh, rather than getting myself killed or losing a black heart over it, why not wait until we actually have some more red hearts? Oh, jeez. Don't have too many red hearts drop, uh, black hearts dropping anymore either. Cheers up. Cheers up. Wonderful. Most wonderful. No idea. Could have been vision. But it isn't. Okay. Um, that's a double key room. Let's see what's inside. I'm not sure. Decent supply of bombs. Alright. See if we can use the blood back, well, the IV back multiple times. No, not anymore. Okay. Although that was a lot of money that got spent bad out by that one thing. Um, I guess it's time to visit a shop.
night light. Yeah. It's on the cheap, why not? Scared of the dark. Alright, let's re-roll the IV bag. So let's go look for a C rooms first. Let's get uh, one of those batteries up. Uh, we got some bombs, so... Nope. Nope. We're really hoping that I would have been able to find that one. Anyway, just one more bomb here, it's not here. Which it is. Okay, is it a special thing? No, it is not. Second secret room. One, two, three... Possible locations? No, it can not be left here, so it has to be here. Blank cards, really? We're doing this now? Oh, jeez. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. I mean, if that's a sun card... Strength. Nope, that's strength. We still need that co-op baby as well. For that, we need blank card. I don't like doing it, but I'm going to do it. Seems we're just going to use you to re-roll that the IV bag. It's great that we can't even see what the cards are, but you know, if we just use blank card on every card we get, then we should be fine. Uh, toothpicks ain't too bad. Some extra shot speed. I can dig it. Yes, sir. I can dig it. Okay. So that's a strength card. I guess we just buy tarot cards whenever we have the opportunity. Tarot cards, tarot cards. She's on the next floor just in case it's something good. Wouldn't want to waste the wondrous effect of it, now do I? And that was the High Priestess. Not a bad card, I suppose we could stick with this one for a while. Flying zombies are not giving a shit about a pentagram drawn on the floor, which makes sense, in all honesty. If we get a uh, change rune, that would be kind of sweet, wouldn't it? Or, yeah, two tears up pills. Um. This could be that, and I mean, I Priestess is good, but we're gonna just see what happens. I think Blank Card works on runes, so... That's fine too. If this is indeed a uh, rune to reroll, then we have a reroll every four turns rather than every six turns. Not that it matters, because, you know, the only time we actually need those rerolls is in deals with a double room. Okay, let's just use it here in case we can figure out what it does. Ah, it's companion. Barcano. I think I'd rather have uh, uh. this card back then. And I've got a key. Wait, can we actually see what the card is when we pick it up? Yeah, it sure shows it. So, right, so that could be exceptionally valuable to us. I'm digging it. So 
So running terrible cards. And Mega Blasts. I suppose at some point. It's bound to run into it. And that's Guppy's head. Why not? <laughs> and the whole thing starts over again like BAH! Good stuff, eh? Anyway, the rod we're carrying, which is a weird time to start talking about that, uh, lengthens the poison effect, so... That's good. Speed ups is nice, pheromones, And health up, help. which... Basically means we've gotten the nine life for free because that could have been a health down. Uh, do we have bombs to get to that? Not nearly enough. No. We can get across, but we can't open up the chest, and then there really is no point in going across now, is there? Uh, it's a bit odd that runes are also hidden. I suppose it has something to do with the fact that they are considered the same. By that I mean, um, just look at how blank card works. I mean, you can still double the effect from runes as well. Which I guess is why we are able to do this. Um, let's use this, see what it does. Destruction. Could be useful, I suppose. Yeah. Maybe you're not exploding or anything weird. <clears throat> well, this could also be a big one. I'll we'll see what we end up with. Um, let's wait. This is not of the mom fight yet. And I like Sandy, what well, not for the fact that it's aiming to where you're moving at, which I suppose makes sense. You want to see where you're going. On the other hand, it doesn't make any sense because, first of all, we're not always looking at where we're going, and it would be much more convenient if we could keep shine a light on what we're shooting at instead. But you know, it is what it is. And it gets rid of Curse of Darkness, so... Um... Not a card will be filled after we fight the boss, so let's do it. Brownie! Slow him down! Ah! He just doesn't give a shit about getting slowed down, does he? See what I did there? I made a joke about proof Well, Yeah. You get it. You get it. In you, um, keep shooting, I guess. And now it's the tiny dingle with a full health bar. You're not slewed, but you didn't melt. Mom's pearls. Let's see what you got. Nothing, because we've been in here and got nine lives, right? Um, so let's see what this thing does. Still the Hagalaz rune. Or another Agalaz rune. Use this one. Okay, that doubles everything. That we don't know what it does, so that might be a reroll. Um, let's keep looking for item rune. So let's just use this thing here. Nah, that's actually a decent item. Uh, let's see if we can get something out of these. Are oh, the answer is no, you cannot. 
Are you not popping up because of the light or? Alrighty then, good luck with your future endeavor. Like this might be a Joker card. One bomb for a potential secret room, which could be here. Cannot be there. No, cannot be there either, which means it's probably here. Or surrounded. Now we got a battery here. Let's see if this is a Joker card then. It's a Chaos card. Okay. Chaos card is nice, but we don't really need it. So it's here or up there. Hmm. You chose poorly. Okay. Well, now we know. What was this thing again? Oh, yeah. Well, let's hoof the Chaos card around a bit. That might have been the reroll, might have not have been. It's weird that they don't say anything about it, though. Hagalaz. Hagalaz is destruction. Or is that Dagaz? Ah. Uh, what a wonderful seed to be messing around with all those runes, eh? Okay. Well, we can get into our boss trap room if you want to. Depending what's inside of it, we may even decide to fight in it. We don't have to go in there after we've dealt with our boss, though. No, we can, because this is Depth 2, is it not? And Acropolis 2. Uh, I don't think... Plays on Blood Bank. Okay, let's just use... Uh, wait. We'll use the blank card when it becomes available. Oh great, another one. Uh, this is our Chaos card, so I know I don't have to use this one again. So let's see what the other one is then. Um, a card that doesn't do anything. Oh wait, did it double our money? Yeah, probably double our money, because that's a two diamonds card then. I suppose we can check up on that by taking it with us and using it again, then I do want to see what this rune does. I hear a key. I can only hope that I cannot get to it. Okay. Ugh. I will need one key to set this whole thing in motion. That's not too much to ask, is it? You think? Easy there, buddies. Easy there. There's plenty of shots for everyone. Ow. Um, yes, we need like a... Uh, metric ton of keys, which is a little less than a crap ton, but slightly more than a shit ton. Does that make sense? No, it is not. I forget what I say sometimes. Blow up a skull, which had nothing in it. Okay, if this is ready, let's uh, just use it here, I suppose. Bracano. Where my keys at? Thank you. Alright, let's go open up the whole shebang there. Which one of these do I still need to use now? I don't remember anymore. I think it was this one. He said after he already left the room and took it with him. Go 
great. Now I have to check out this tarot card as well. I still had a rune test, right? Yeah. So we'll do that. On where the item pedestal is, just to see if it's one that rerolls stuff. It doesn't matter, we got another spare black heart right here. Yeah. Okay, show me the money. Is this a reroll or not? Kind of important, you know? Kind of important. No, nope, it's a day gods room. Alright. We have a room with rocks in it, we probably have one of those, yeah. But we have a room with. Ah, that's. Dagos is purity, right. Okay, so let's get to our cursor room. It has another rune in it. Another Dagos room. Hmm. Alright, let's open her up. This does not interfere with deals with the double chances, or so I've been told. Let's go after a boss. See if this is a choker card, which would be nice if I could do that without actually having to use it. But unfortunately, I'm not getting any keys that would grant me entry to my shop. Might as well go do this, right? There you go. There's another HP up for us. Mark Rock. Could you stomp on that for me, please? Thank you. I was stuck in there. Didn't even realize. That's how much I'm paying attention to my character at certain times. Anyway, more black hearts. Pretty sure I'm not gonna be doing boss rush. Looking at the timer. Sun cards generally aren't that rare, but you know. It's two things that need to happen simultaneously, you getting a Getting blank card and a sun card. Not to mention all the bullshit that's going on with Mega Blast that's just simply refusing to show up. Now, the same thing happened with Brimstone, but eventually that did end up making an appearance. If this is a reroll, this could be quite a problem. <laughs> and the one time I don't want it to be a reroll, it's a reroll. Hmm. Ugh, let's take experimental treatment. It looks like our damage went up a bit. <sighs> Chaos card. Chaos card apparently also destroys rocks. Give me a sec. Thought someone was at the door. It wasn't. This game's getting to me. Okay, geez. Slow down, alright? Love me! No. And. You're gonna get killed by a bird. There you go. That must be good for confidence. Cheers up. Sure. Don't think it does anything at this point. 
So we've got no cards whatsoever now. So that doesn't last too long because blank card is now just sitting here doing nothing at all. Come on, sun card. You know you want to give me one. Now, that also means we're ending this on either Shoal or Cathedral. Uh, I suppose we'll go Shoal then. Why not? I swear I'm hearing something and I don't like it. The Fallen! Well, that's another... Whoa. Yeah, that's a gigantic one. And are you getting hurt by that? No, you're not, because you're just an inch of the ground. Okay. And we get Guppy's paw. Not bad. We're one item away from the guppy transformation, so that's nice. And there it is. There you go. Guppy! And now we can fly as well. Um, we don't have Polaroid or anything, so... Pff, red hearts, black hearts, it's pretty much all the same at this point. Alright, we've got one more chance. After that, we can... Pretty much cut the run short. I'm gonna go after Satan because why not? But um, this is basically our last chance of anything happening. I mean, yeah, there's still blank heart that can grant us the sun card shenanigan. If you ever find the sun card, I mean, there's only 22 terra cards. Going from 0 to 21. So it is possible. I mean, there's like a little less than 5% chance that every carol card that drops is the one we're looking for. find a better time to pop up, could it? Ah, uh, jeez, we don't care about the eternal hearts. Put a bomb here just because. There we go. That's a lot better. Home Deco. With a little bit of elbow grease. What was our card again? Two of something, right? Yeah. Yeah, might as well, right? Double the bombs, double the fun. Yet I'm not using them at all. <sighs> well, it seems to be another run where we accomplish nothing. One more devil room to go, though. So. Well, I mean, one potential devil room to go. Flies. And we didn't even get that. Alright, see what this is. Agalaz again. Let's go. You can give tarot cards. Or you can just give me an HP up. 
which I really have no need for. Sweet. <clears throat> what are you? That was another change rune. It doesn't matter at this point. Unless we find a sun card, this has been another run where we do nothing on. I don't even know if I have to do the blank card shenanigan thing. Um, to get 100%, but you know, might as well unlock everything, right? But I'll be happy once I've gotten all of the items, because that means I no longer have to be on the lookout for specific things. Agalaz rune, uh, can you have a sail or something? We yeah, had pretty shitty moment to uh, actually get blank card on because we can't see what our tarot cards are nor what our runes were. But hey, that's just the game throwing you another curved one. Huh? One of these days we'll get what we need. Thanks for the steam sale. Suppose I might as well leave that here. Little ghosty dudes. Isaac's fork. See if this is a change rune. Might as well manage to make something from that item. No. A was that passage? Hmm. Strange, 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 strange. All right, let's end this. Timing perfect as always. Eat them flies. Okay, let's just end it. Never even gonna wait. Perfect timing. You can't defeat a little boy, Satan. What are you thinking? All right, that's gonna do it. been a while since I've seen this one. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you're still enjoying the series. Feel free to support by coming, liking, and or subbing if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye, everyone.